Today you become my wife and I become your husband. I would have never guessed that the day I met you, I met my future wife. I thank the Lord every day for blessing me with you. You are more than anything I could have ever hoped for. Proverbs 31 must have been written with a woman like you in mind, a wife of noble character who can find. She is worth far more than rubies. She is clothed with strength and dignity. She can laugh at the days to come. She speaks with wisdom and faithful instruction is on her tongue. Many women do noble things, but you surpass them all. I'm so excited to begin life with you. I will honor you, laugh with you, and cry with you. I will always be present for you. I will cook for you and give you back rubs. I will lead our family in a godly home. I'm looking forward to all the wonderful memories you and I will share together. I love you, Monica. <laughs> I hope you can read that. <laughs> Is that a yes? Yes. Wow. <laughs> Whew. Wow. You look amazing. <laughs> That's beautiful. I love you. I love you. To you, Matthew Whitmire, I vow to encourage you and inspire you. I vow to support you and give you my everlasting devotion, loyalty, and respect. I vow to offer forgiveness every day. I vow to walk... <laughs> <laughs> I'll need a lot of it. <laughs> <laughs> I vow to walk by your side through the good and the bad. I vow to share moments of laughter, sorrow, and joy with you. I vow to love you unconditionally forever and ever. Matthew. You're ready, buddy, aren't you? I'm ready. <laughs> Matthew, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> it's my honor to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Matthew Whitmire. Yeah! <laughs>